Good evening, this is the Spicy Sage here, and I have um, spent the day in the park and shopping, and now I'm in a Van Dien, I'm in a restaurant, and it's a Muslim restaurant because uh, I am a vegetarian, and I can be guaranteed that I won't uh, get any pork or beef in, or chicken in my food if I ask for it. So I ordered uh, me and Tao and vegetables, and uh, they came, they're actually hand-pulled noodles. I ordered the hand-pulled noodles, and I'm gonna go ahead and, and taste them. And sh let me sh show you what they look like. It's a beautiful looking dish. So as you can see, they're hand-pulled, and uh, they've got the vegetables in there, and it's a great big bowl. I'll never eat all of this. Uh, I, I'm just not a, a big eater, and I need to eat slowly. So uh, we have the hand pulled noodles with the vegetables, and uh, I put a little uh, chili sauce on it because I do like it easy and la. So uh, let's go ahead and, and taste the uh, noodles. Too big. <laughs> I don't know, like, uh, I mean, if you ever watch Trevor James or Mark Wings, uh, those guys can like put, put the whole thing in their mouth. I, I can't do that. <laughs> Okay, hold on. Mmm. Oh my God. Oh my God. Hen hao chi. Hen hao chi. That means delicious. I've never, never tasted noodles so good. Jalen Glor, they hand pull the noodles. I'm afraid. Jalen, I think they're better than you. Jalen's my cousin, by the way. And she's like the best cook in the world. These hand-pulled noodles, Jalen, I think they got you beat. They got mushrooms in here. This is beautiful. The dish is so aromatic. Let's eat the mushroom. Oops. Mushrooms, and then they have vegetables. And it's just a simple dish, but it's so elegantly done. It's so aromatic. Let me give me another bite of these hand-pulled noodles. Kidding, it's so tasty. Mmm. Mmm. So good. Mm. Mm. And then, got some kind of bread with chives in it. You see that? Nice and fresh. Take a bite of this. Mmm. Oh my God. It's got that soft, chewy texture. Mm. Chives and garlic. Mm. So good. Good old comfort food. This whole meal will probably cost 15 RMB, which is maybe $2 US dollars. Obviously, I'm an American. Cola. So, when you're in China, it's very important for you to expand your horizons. When I asked for a cheap but delicious place to eat, they thought I wanted to go to McDonald's. I said, oh my God, just take me away from McDonald's. I want Chinese food. And they laughed. So, they uh, were nice enough to show me this place, and it is fabulous. Don't, don't eat Kentucky Fried Chicken in China. Don't eat McDonald's in China. Eat Chinese food in China. Also, uh, this place I can sincerely say 10 out of 10. How ping. This place has how ping good reviews. But if you come to a place in China that you know you don't like the food, uh, you need to go ahead and be respectful. You need to be kind and considerate. And you need to say you like that food because the cook worked hard. And. Uh, just be respectful of the culture, you know, like uh, you would do the same thing at a friend's house in America If you didn't like the food you wouldn't just like say oh your food is disgusting So uh, I'm gonna sign off here because I have got to finish my dinner And then uh, I'm going to turn in for the night because I have to go to Shenzhen in the morning and then on to Hong Kong so uh, my new adventures await me and mm, I burnt Again, those cokes are so bubbly. So my new adventures await me, and um, please like and subscribe to my videos. I'm producing like one a day, and uh, I still don't have 100 subscribers yet. 
Uh, thank you for subscribing and liking to my videos, but until I get 100 subscribers, uh, you know, uh, I really would, you know, uh, I enjoy doing the videos, but uh, I, I do need to uh, get more subscribers uh, on board. I need to get more followers. It is important for us to understand, uh, uh, to be culturally aware and understand that we need to be bilingual. And when you're bilingual, you could order delicious me and Tao, Edie and La, Hu Loa Boa, Me and Bao Cafe, Wiza. Okay, so I know a lot of uh, sketchy Mandarin. <laughs> okay, Spicy Sage here signing out. See you on the other side.